savages, you a fuck boy, you can't hang. You can find me posted up on Frank Block with my fucking gang. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Boone coming at you guys with a brand new lesbian exclusive of the new Supreme Week 4. This is an annoying intro, but we got an even more annoying release because I am not a fan of this Nike shit. Like, I never really liked the Nike collaborations we see from Supreme. I was shopping yesterday, recording a little bit, and I pulled up on Lucky Dog. You guys know if you're from Seattle, Lucky Dog is like the hype spot of Seattle. I actually saw the Nike Spectrums in person, and those shits are fi. I'm not even gonna front. Like, even though the shoe has flames on it and calling it fi is really annoying, it's fi. It's a really sick shoe, so I will say there are some good supreme nike collabs but for every good nike collaboration we get we also receive like five other just booty disgusting ones that's how we end up with those like jolly rancher joints that's how we end up with that nike nba like puke all over logo bullshit what i don't even know bro most of the nike collabs i'm not a fan of let me know what you guys think of nike collabs with supreme um i just never really liked them like i used to the quilted Damn, sbs son, <laughs> crazy the snakeskin air maxes Oh, like, oh my God, bro. They have some insane collabs, but I feel like recently, Supreme and Nike have just really tried to make it as obscure as possible. They really seem to like to grab these Bruh. older model shoes and relaunch them. That's what we're getting with these, what are they called? Uh, Nike Air Tailwind. The first thing I think of when I hear Tailwind is some corny, like, little kids, like, scooter brand. I have no idea why. Shout out to all my scooter kids one time, but really, shout out to my espresso. Like, look how we're matching right now, bro. I did get these from Lucky Dog. Shout out to Lucky Dog for real, but let's begin this video. Um, smash a like if you guys enjoy these cringy reviews of the Supreme Weeks. I don't know why you'd enjoy this, but if you do, you're the GOAT. You know that. Let's begin the video, though. I'm gonna stop the annoyingness. We're about to teleport on to the Supreme website right now. I'll see you guys there, let's begin. So here we are on the Supreme website and we are looking at the photos posted by Supreme this morning. Um, I gotta say like the lookbook photos Supreme does are so bizarre, like you would think they'd have homies doing some dope shit or like, I don't know, in some cool area, but no, we've got this dude sitting in the side of a car with these brick ass shoes. I mean, the dude like looks not hype at all to be doing this lookbook shoot. He almost doesn't want to be seen in these shoes and I can't blame him because these look like they're speckled in men's semen, which is not the vibe at all for me. Um, I remember when these were leaked or like getting leaked. I thought they were Air Maxes originally and I was kind of hyped, but no, we got these off brand Air Max like bullshits that Nike's trying to bring back. I don't know, I'm just not feeling these shoes at all. Like, I do love Air Maxes. Um, as much as I shit on Nike shoes, I'm a huge fan of Air Maxes. Um, 97s go so crazy, but these are not the ones, and I really don't like, like, the little colors they chose. Blue outline, we got, like, a little copper. Like, I, oh, let's go to the next. <laughs> these are so bad, bro. Like, what in the hell? These look like some shits homies would be wearing when they get bullied at school. Like, these are the shoes your mom took you to, like, the department store. $50 and you're like mom can we please just go to Nike she's like nah bitch we broke you buying these shits I believe this is like the little raindrop drop top like wet design that we saw on like that arc logo hoodie I clowned that for being semen splattered and this is no exception folks the branding is pretty cool I do like how they did it um, we got like a little sleeve on the tongue as well as like a little back spell out usually Supreme Nike branding isn't too like seen or pronounced so this is a lot of branding for a Nike shoe which is a plus like that's the only plus of these shoes for me personally um, let me know what you guys think of these I don't want to clown these too hard for the people that like them because this is just like not a sneaker for me at all I never really expect these Nike collabs to like end up as something I would want for myself because you guys know me I like to be rocking all these like white shoes they're super minimal like not a lot going on I love leather and stuff like these are just not my alleyway at all so let's move on to the next photo I want to see these red ones all right so the red ones I will say are not as bad nowhere near as bad as the other colorway um, these ones are bearable like I just said I like the white shoes like so the fact these have white highlights like your boy could actually get a little brazy with this matchup you know what I'm saying we could go crazy on the gram one time go follow me please I'm almost at 7k this is a nice colorway I'm not gonna lie I prefer these way over the other colorway the darker set um, homie looks like Shia LaBeouf a little bit just 
do it. No flex in this photo. Like again, this dude does not want to be seen in these. He's looking to the side, wearing all black hoodie on. Like people that are taking these lookbook photos don't want to be associated with these shoes, which means they must be a brick. So um, I don't know why these lookbook photos are so ass. This is a super annoying shot. Like who takes a photo like this? Who sits like this? Just think about the way this dude is sitting right now. Mmm, comfy. Um, super annoying. Let's keep moving. All right, so here's an actual photo of the shoes. So we got a little air bubble in the back for you to pop like your girl's cherry. We got this copper outline that I just hate. Um, the like little raindrop drop top semen splatter. Um, I Bro, like, what is this colorway? I'm sorry, like, who thought this was a cool colorway? There's no, like, team colors that are like this. No one wears outfits with these colors. Like, I don't know who was planning this shoe, but they just fucked up. Like, they were just trying to troll Supreme or something. They're like, hmm, let's make a shoe that's gonna sit online just like that ugly-ass Timberland. And they're like, oh, well, let's do it, bro. That's what this shoe embodies to me. It is just absolute brickage. I see this, and I want to build a house out of it. Um, but this red color, oh, no, they're gonna make us keep looking at this. Air Max on the tongue, cool. Um, I please get me away from these. That little back branding is pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Um, get me away from these, please. All right, so these joints is I. They're not that sick. Like I don't know, bro. They're not really for me. Like I've been saying, I do like these ten times more than the blacks. Like you guys gotta let me know your favorite colorway. I would assume most people would go with this classic Supreme colorway. Um, the colors actually make sense. They go together. You could wear this with actual outfits. Um, where with the black shoes like I just I don't know bro those are too random these ones are cool I could definitely do without the semen splatter but it's whatever like that's supreme sauce I guess that's the James Jebbia secret formuli you feel me like this is what's in Krabby Patties ravioli ravioli give me the formuli I don't even know if that made sense, but these shoes are making a little bit of sense. Like they are some grandpa sneaker wave. Um, I guess that's the new thing in fashion though. So that's a vibe. Um, I definitely like that black Supreme font. Like that really pops. The Supreme branding looks a lot nicer on these. Let's take a look at the backs. Yeah, that black is really nice. It pops on the white, gorgeous. Nice. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of rocking with these. Like I could see myself maybe buying these. I don't really want to. I'd more so do it for the fans because like I would not rock these for the personal but maybe like we could figure something out where I might like, rock these for a photo I don't know bro retails I've heard are gonna be kind of taxing like look at the comparison we got a white and red shoe that's really not too bad like it's not my favorite but I would not even roast it really I think it's a cool if I saw someone wearing that you know I wouldn't be like bro what are those like I'd be I'd be chilling with it. I'd be like, all right I feel like he's got that little like bootleg ass Air Maxes but if I see man's in these black shoes bro like his whole family and ancestry is getting absolutely bought because he deserves it. What are these shits, Boy, man? The blue with the copper with the secret formulae. The like just everything looks bad on these shits. I don't like these at all. I do wish they had made these little outer sides 3M and it looks like there's potential for those to be 3M. I think they might even be. I'm not positive though. It looks awful on the black shoe. Like it just looks so bad. It looks normal on the white. Everything about this black shoe is just terrible to me. Please don't buy that colorway. We have to teach Supreme a lesson for releasing that black color because I feel like there's so many other colorways they could have gone with. I don't know why they chose that shit. Um, next, we got these hats. I did forget they did these hats as well. And the hats are pretty cool. Like, I don't really rock with that style of hat. This is more of like a camp cap look. And you guys know me, I'm S Logo Shoddy. So these are not really for me. I do think these are 10 times more clean than the shoes. It sucks we don't have like track pants or like anything else for this collab because I could see some potential for this design to look kind of cool. Um, it is semen splatter vibe. So like, I don't know why I just called it cool. I guess I'm sus for that. Um, but I don't know. I could see on track pants or a track jacket is looking kind of dope. I wish that we had just gotten more because the shoes aren't really cutting it for me. The red ones are nice though. I'm not gonna lie. The red ones are kind of sick. I almost want to get a pair. I'm gonna think about it. Let me know what you guys think of these shoes though. I'm very curious. We do also have some like rumors of t-shirts releasing this week. I don't know about that though, if we're gonna actually get them or if they're gonna be good. That's yet to be announced. I don't wanna be on my CNN shit and give you guys fake news. So that's the video. I hope you all enjoy this. Ben, your boy Boone. Um, more cringy intros and shit coming soon. I wasn't like feeling the vibe today to really get on my cringe game. My girl's pulling up on me yet again. So we're gonna do some other video. I I have no idea what um, I hope you guys enjoyed though follow me on Instagram 
Um, yeah, like bless your boy one time. I love you all though. Thank you for watching all the way through to my soldiers, my warriors, my goats. You guys are the real ones. It's been your boy Boone. I've said that 50 times. I'm out. Peace.